All right, Tim. Disappointing, you know, finish to the EWL. Uh, well, you guys got one more tomorrow with WBU. Match. But, you know, disappointing finish to the match there. Uh, Bergstor couldn't go out. You know, he needed a pin. I don't know if you're going to pin. I don't know if anyone's going to pin Tomei, but, you know, uh, what do you guys take from this, and what do you want your guys to, to really learn from this duel? I think the guys who won went out uh, and wrestled really hard, and the guys who lost went out to feel the guy out, or they didn't go out to whip someone's tail. And, you know, that's what we talked about in the locker room was, You've got to go out to kick someone's butt, and, and we had it at some weights, and we didn't at others, and you know that was the difference. I, you know they had a little more energy in the, in the uh, earlier matches. I mean we, we need to get some of those. I mean we, you lose four of the close bouts. I mean that's that's the match, you know. So 125, uh, one of your highest ranked guys, Eric Moore. Looked like he just didn't have anything in the tank. Is he maybe not cutting his weight right or something like that? Ah uh, no, I, I think it's more mental. I, you know, kids, it gets the end of the year. And, He'll be fine, but he didn't. He didn't wrestle well. I know that he didn't wrestle. Actually, I shouldn't say well. He didn't wrestle, but um, he'll be okay. Tomorrow night's a new night, and you know we've challenged those guys to go out and throw it on West Virginia. All right, 174 pounds, man. Phil Maracone is just absolutely gaining steam. It looks like he's really getting healthy. What's he doing differently from now, you know, compared to the beginning just, of the season? We just got to keep him healthy. I mean, but Phil wrestles the way we want our guys to wrestle. He goes out and tries. You know, and um, usually that's a good thing, especially uh, if you're a decent wrestler. And we have a lot of good wrestlers, but they, they've got to go out and try like Phil did. And I told him, go back and watch Phil's match. How many attacks, how he's driving them out. I mean, it's no secret. I mean, to, to win any kind of combat, you've got to be, you know, you've got to have the aggression. And we didn't have it in some ways. I think Jared is back to 100%. I hope so. Yeah. And he looked good tonight. So we'll see. Uh, um, he's been training pretty hard, so I, you know I think he's gonna he'll be fine. In a match like this for the EWL title, you as a coach personally, do you bring a uh, a Jared King back who's 50 to 75 percent? I don't think at this time of the year I would have. No, you know we didn't do that. I even told the staff, you know, earlier in the week if he wasn't ready to go. No is the answer. You know it's just too close to the to the nationals, and um, you know we wanted him to be you know pretty much close to 100 percent. You guys, uh, you told me, some people were telling me maybe you guys didn't get the calls tonight or something like that. You told me it didn't matter. You told me it didn't matter. No, you, you, you make the calls. You know what I mean? I mean, one match, and John, John shouldn't have been in that position. So, you know, you have to, we can't analyze the official and change him. You know, it, it's not his fault. It's not his fault that uh, John Gresheimer gave up uh, six other points. You know, so we focus on what we can fix. You know, um, we lost seven matches to three. The tonight, Pitt beat us. All right, 197. What do you tell Fendoni? You know, in a situation like that, and what do you think? Don't fall off. Don't fall off. Yeah. Stop throwing legs, yeah. maybe a little bit. He wrestled hard. I mean, yeah, it's uh, sometimes he gets a little high, and the guy, you know, the guy reversed him. So, it, but you know, he was trying really hard to turn the guy, and he he was a guy that had some effort for us. So, I think he'll be okay. All right, we'll be over at your place tomorrow. WVU. Thanks for the time, Coach, uh, and uh, good luck. Hopefully a big